What's up? I'm Troubleshoot. Welcome back to another video. In this quick guide, I'll be showing you how to fix an issue that you could be getting if you're on a Windows 11 Insider build, whether it be Dev, Canary, whatever. Any one of the Insider builds can result in this issue, and the solution is relatively simple. If I open up Steam and head across to Call of Duty, trying to launch it, you'll see an error pop up. This is the error here. Unsupported operating system. Your operating system Windows 11 is not supported. Upgrade to Windows 10 or newer. Obviously, this message makes zero sense as Windows 11 is newer than Windows 10, and they're suggesting to upgrade by downgrading. Very confusing, but essentially what this means is that the Windows 11 Insider build that you're currently running isn't yet supported by Call of Duty. Now they are aware of this, Activision do have it listed on their Trello board as an issue they will be fixing, so it will be worked on in the future, but if you need to play Call of Duty for some reason and you're not able to, the solution is relatively simple. Hit start, open up settings, navigate across to Windows Update, followed by Update History here, scroll down to the very bottom and click Uninstall Updates. Now in this section here, you're looking for anything that has the word beta in it. If you're running certain versions of Windows 11 Insider, you'll find things like feature enablement for beta channel preview, etc, etc. By simply uninstalling those, using the buttons on the right hand side, restarting when they're all done, and you may have to restart between uninstalling each one, really depends on what kinds of updates you have. By the end of it, you should be able to play Call of Duty again. Now, if you're in an unfortunate situation like I am, where you're running the Canary version and you don't see any of these beta updates here, or any in the updates history section here as well, the only solution is to leave the Insider program and go back to the normal standard release of Windows 11. Now, obviously, this is a huge step because you can have to reinstall everything, fully back up everything and restore everything to simply reinstall Windows just to get back into the game. Now, they are aware of this and they are working on a fix, so more than likely, probably before the end of the week, they'll have a fix out and you'll be able to play Call of Duty again. But for me, I've been having a few issues with notably Valorant Call of Duty. There are no issues anywhere else with Insider, but unfortunately, I will need to downgrade anyway. To do so, you can head across to the Windows Update section, Windows Insider Program, and inside of here, you'll see under Stop Getting Preview Builds, two options. One of them is blurred out for me here, which is basically when the next major update of Windows 11 comes, don't update further. Instead, go to the Release Channel, which is an option, but for me, it's grayed out here. The second option is to unenroll immediately, but this will result in Windows being completely reinstalled. You'll lose everything you have. So at this point, if you're stuck in this unfortunate situation, either you need to wait for Call of Duty to fix themselves, or you need to go back to the latest stable release of Windows 11 by reinstalling and nuking everything. If you choose the second option, make sure you back up absolutely everything, including your app data, local app data, and other hidden configuration files, settings, etc., as you will be losing everything if you completely reinstall. Anyways, that's really about it for this quick guide. Hopefully you found this useful. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.